What's up gamers, it's Gaming Thunder Rat, and today is my 20th birthday, yeah guys, it's my birthday, yay, yeah, I'm not really that psyched about it, Dad. and uh, I'm alone this birthday again, and uh, but to get my mind off it, why don't we do an unboxing video? <music> On the table we have uh, everything, Bakugan. And, uh, okay, we got back on Armor Alliance, uh, uh, Baku Gear Pack. We got Cosplay Kubo, um, uh, from Exclusive Target. We have, uh, the Bakugan Geogon Rising Unbox and Brawl. And the Bakugan Armored Alliance, um, Premium Battle Arena. And the has, uh, cost a bit, and, uh, cost a pretty penny. And, yeah, uh, but I think this was worth it. Very good financial decision for me. So, I'm gonna be unboxing this stuff. Um, uh, let's start off uh, with uh, the cosplay Cabo set. Outside of the box, the two couple look absolutely adorable. Um, uh, we see we have one uh, dressed as Dragonoid, and we have one dressed as Nilius. And uh, uh, you can see here uh, that they look uh, absolutely adorable. We can fold them up, um, and we can also remove uh, the hat, um, so we can roll them out. So let's test it out. Let me just... Okay, sometimes it's just best to just put it on there. Um, but, and then we could just snap their hat in. I have them sitting not on the gay card that, that were on there. Let's take a look at um, that. We have uh, a couple got uh, gay card uh, that I have them sitting on that uh, keeps them properly balanced. And and we have another couple gay card. And uh, and this also came uh, with four Baku cores and, uh, and two uh, um, what cards. Um, we have uh, the Cabo dressed as Nilius, and we have uh, Dragon One and dressed Cabo. Um, so this was actually very nice, and I'm I'm going to keep this box because this looks very unique, and uh, I like the design of it, and so I'll definitely be keeping that box. Now let's get on to the next cosplay Cabo um, pack. And um, yeah, it comes here with two cosplay Cabos, uh, one a magician and one of them a cowboy. And it also comes with two Bakugan, we have Pegatrix, and we have Trox. And uh, this is a Target exclusive, and, uh, and this looks very nice. So we have uh, two more cosplay Cabos uh, to add to the collection. Outside of the box, uh, we have the two cosplay Cabos, and, uh, and we have Trox and Pegatrix by their sides. And, uh, and, uh, and uh, we have some uh, gay cards right here, let's take a look at them. Okay, we got... Four uh, unique uh, gate cards, and that, uh, and we got uh, the cards right here. Let's see, what we've got we got a uh, Cabo, and we got on uh, the other Cabo, Pegatrix, and Trox. It also came out uh, with eight Baku cores, and uh, so this looks uh, very unique, very similar uh, to Dragonoid and Nilly's cosplay ones. This one's a cowboy, and yeah, and this one's a magician, and uh, and we got two extra Baku on uh, the brawl with. And so I'd say this was a major success with this uh, uh, little playset. Next we have uh, is the Baku Gear pack with Pyrus Trox Ultra with his Baku Gear and Darkest uh, Pegatrix uh, Ultra. And uh, I like the way this box looks. And uh, on the back, uh, you see it comes with Trox, Pegatrix, Hydrus, and Centipod. Um, not bad. And uh, so, come on, let's unbox this baby. And out of the box, uh, we have uh, Trox with his Baku gear, Pegatrix, Hydrus, and Centipod. We have their cards right here. We have Centipod, Trox Ultra, Pegatrix Ultra, Hydrus, and uh, the Pyru Cannon, and uh, Dark Honda uh, Draggers, Baku Thrusters, and uh, and uh, Chaos Bracer. And uh, so this is very nice. And it also came with a few booklet of instructions. Didn't come with any gay cards uh, for this one, and, uh, but luckily for us, we still have one right here, uh, so we can roll out Centipod. And nice. And and now let's roll out Hunter uh, Hydrus. Uh, there we go. And uh, nice. This pack Hanka was really good. And uh, now let's move on to the next one. 
Next up is the Bakugan Geogun Rising Unboxing Brawl. I got this baby at Amazon. It was an Amazon exclusive. And uh, let's take a look at the back. And uh, we get uh, two Geogun and, uh, and four Bakugan. And um, this looks very nice. Very nice awkward design, I must say. And yeah, I cannot wait uh, to unbox this baby. And out of the box, uh, we have the two Geogun uh, and the four Bakugan that come with it. And uh, along with them uh, came uh, some gate cards and ability cards. Let's see. We got, let's see, six gate cards. And we have, I'm not, not sure if you can see this. Okay, we got Fennica, uh, Sharktar, Oxidox, uh, Falcron, Titan King, and ooh, a very nice looking uh, uh, Arkelion card. You know, my one problem with this actually is that this card says for the darkest Bakugan is Oxidox. And uh, yet somehow in the ba Hansa uh, it says uh, Hansa Hambaba. Or Hambaba. Uh, I'm not sure how to pronounce it. Uh, and, uh, but see, big error for Spin Masters uh, and, and uh, Amazon. But I think it's alright. And uh, I'm gonna let that slide. It also came out with about, and, uh, let's see, six Baku cores. And, uh, I may be wrong. It also came out with a and, uh, booklet of instructions. Now, what we're gonna do, what I'm about, let, let's just grab a card out and, uh, and roll them out. Let's start off uh, with the Baku gun. Let's start off with Oxidox. And, all right. Another one. And we have uh, Oxidox out here. Let's take a look at him. Not bad. Not bad at all. Um, it's a very good looking hang back gun. Ooh, but low power though. Only 200 B power. Anyway, let's go on to Fennica. Alright, let's see. Come on, get on the... There we go. Um, we got Fennica right here. Um, um... Not bad. Uh, uh, this can also uh, pop out and just go back in. I think this is when you fold it. Yeah, that's when you uh, roll it up. Um, so that's a little unique. You have 700 uh, B power for Fennica. Uh, not, not bad. And uh, now let's go with Shark Tar. Yeesh. Never um, uh, be able to pop them open. Let me try this. Uh... It's just, and we have Shark Tar. All right, nice looking Bakugan. Very unique uh, Aquas Bakugan. On that, we have uh, 500 and B power on him. Now for the last Bakugan, we're gonna check out Balkron. Uh, that one went easier than expected. We have Falcron on uh, that with 400 B power. Not bad, and not pretty good. Now, um, uh, finally, let's move on now to the um, to the Geogon. And uh, all right, let's start off with Titan King. Nice, that's very good looking. And uh, Titan King, uh, and uh, it's looking uh, and uh, tough. Um, uh, very nice looking Geogon. And I uh, finish it off with my man and uh, Arkelion. Hun. Um, Nice. This looks uh, really unique. Just like I got the same one I have uh, for Geogon Decaform, I still call it Decagon. And uh, I don't know if it sounds uh, wrong or not, I just call it that. And so this was very nice. And uh, this is a nice Ponza deck we have right here. Um, we got um, four new uh, Bakugan and two new Geogon. And now let's wrap this up uh, with the last item. Finally, we end this video off uh, with the biggest uh, one yet. And uh, the Bakugan Battle League Coliseum. Um, uh, this thing is incredibly big. Let's turn this over. Um, uh, you see we have a big arena where you can hold uh, three Bakugan. And it has a storage system so you can hold your cards. And, uh, and even comes out uh, with a, 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 a bonus Bakugan, Halcor X Serpentees. And uh, so let's unbox this big baby. And yeah, and uh, play.
and out of the box and fully built, uh, we have uh, the Bakugan on uh, Battle League Coliseum. And, and here we have uh, is Anza uh, Howcore X Serpentis. This arena looks really good. And uh, we could put Bakugan here and everything. And uh, this is a lot bigger than I expected. Um, but I'm happy I got it. And so let's roll out Anza uh, Howcore. And it already came out just like that. And uh, so let's take a look at how core nice looking. It's got a lot of gold on that. So I think this one's pretty good. And you can also put out his legs. And we have his B power 400. So I think this was very good. And uh, this is a nice uh, little thing that uh, we got here. Hope you guys uh, like this unboxing video. Uh, this was fun to do. Uh, and it cost a little bit of money. Yeah, but and uh, I think it was worth it. What do you guys think? And I think it was worth it. Let me know in the comments uh, if you think it was. So yeah, this birthday was okay, I guess. Not the best as I thought. But anyway, hey guys, that's the end of the video. Uh, thanks for watching. And um, be sure to subscribe to Micron And uh, video games for fun. It's by the gaming. And uh, comment, like, subscribe. Join my Discord. And uh, see you guys in the next video. This is Game Thunder. Signing out. <laughs>